We're on our way to Hollywood Studios. We are gonna go take the Skyliner over. We're not rushing to get in for early entry because we actually rode a lot of the rides last night. We are gonna get some Mickey waffles and get a Starbucks and just sit and enjoy the vibes of the studios this morning. Because today- All the feels this morning. Today's supposed to be record-breaking heat. So we're not about running around. We're just gonna enjoy the magic. Then we're gonna come back and swim. And then tonight we'll go to Epcot for our final night of fireworks. So that's the plan today. We're just walking over to the Skyliner. It's a beautiful morning right now. So we like that, but it's only gonna get crazy hot. And sadly, we have to go home tomorrow. Wedding week is over, but it's been amazing. We weren't planning on it, but we actually got in the park for the early entry. Just flukily, randomly. Anyway, we're in, so we thought, well, we'll just ride Mickey and Minnie's, and then we'll have our breakfast, because it's not busy at all right now. So, might as well take advantage. Hey, Lair. Carrie changed the plans on us, as she always does. She gets in the park and starts getting, getting the a FOMO. Bit of the ride FOMO. We should be rushing. We should be rushing. It's just have it. Just have it at Disney. Rush here, rush there. And today we're gonna try to not. <laughs> He's laughing. We were supposed to do that. It's supposed to be the last day vibe day. Yeah, we're, we're still gonna do that. But we'll just do this one quickly. Breakfast of champs here. Right on sunset, right by the Tower of Terror. Scoops ice cream. $10 for three Mickey waffles, whipped cream, and strawberries. And then have all the syrups. Looks pretty good. Well, thanks, Kayla, for telling us about this little hidden secret of Mickey waffles down at Scoops. Because we did not know about this. So thanks for telling us. Uh, not supposed to be. We are yeah. scoops <laughs> so beside the tower. There's about four errors there. Well, Where are you? You guys I'm are eating. used to my errors. But I'm now, eating, if you're not, and Kayla's at an ice cream parlor inside the tower. Both are wrong. So what's ever? Very 
-hmm. Okay, Ronto wrap is amazing. It's so good. I feel like that's my new favorite thing yeah. here. Yeah. Delicious. Like and subscribe for that. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think of it, Lair? You know what? Worth the hype. So good. It's like okay. a street vendor sausage combo thing. So good. It's like a sauce on it. I don't know what it is, but it's yeah. a little cool shareable. Delicious. Like, just grab it. Grab a couple of people just quick bite. So good. Well worth it. Baseline tap house for the Mickey pretzel. No, it's not Mickey shapes. Regular, right? Regular Regu pretzel. Regular pretzel. Beer cheese. Beer cheese. Charcuterie, which they have just destroyed. But we'll see if we're getting one. so good. What about that drink you have there? It's a strawberry lemonade, just regular, but they said you can add a shot if you want to. I've There's waited two the, years for this. Charcuterie at Baseline Tap House. And here is the pretzel with a mustard and a cheese sauce. And what drinks did you guys get? A uh, hazy little thing. A hazy. Blood, blood orange cider. 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 Yeah. Lemonade slushy right by the entrance. When it's this hot out, this hits the spot. It was like $4.95, but it's so hot out that this is great. Stop that little banana cabana to get a little snack. What are we uh, gonna get? We're gonna get some Caribbean chips and dip. Some slushy drinks here. And we're back at Epcot for the evening. Our last evening, sadly. We have dinner reservations tonight at the Rose and Crown Pub. So we haven't eaten there before, so we're looking forward to that. It's still really hot out. So I think it's like five o'clock and it's still like over a hundred degrees. So it's a toasty one. It's a busy night in Epcot tonight, holiday weekend. Well, we just had dinner at the UK Pavilion Pub. It was really good. We had fish and chips. The boys had a Guinness. What'd you think of it, Lair? Delicious. I haven't had fish and chips in ages. Actually quite good, but we easily could have shared. Yeah, really big portion. So if you're going there, you could share. Totally. Did you like it, Braid? Delicious. Claire had her first sip of Guinness. Yeah, I had my first sip of Guinness. It was pretty good, actually. Wouldn't drink a whole one, but it was good. But you'll drink a half one. <laughs> I have not wanted to try a Guinness. Oh, I think I took a sip once. What? I don't feel I didn't like it. The Guinness. Of course not. Larry loves a Guinness. Being Irish and all, of course he loves a Guinness. So we've got a spot on the bridge for fireworks. It's a great spot, so we're super pumped about that because when this is over, the skyliner is just over there on the other side of the bridge. And this is our viewing spot, I'll show you. Yeah, this is our viewing spot for tonight's fireworks. So we're pretty happy about this spot. <laughs> Why stand like that? <laughs> How about these firework cruises? I don't know the cost, but I think that's a sweet idea.
always end our Disney trip in Epcot. We love spending our final night watching the amazing fireworks that Epcot has. It's always the perfect ending to an amazing week. This trip was even more special to us because our beautiful daughter Kayla got married at the most magical place on earth right here in Walt Disney World, a memory we will forever cherish. If you've enjoyed this wedding series or want to see more of our crazy Disney adventures, don't forget to click the subscribe button. And with that, we will say good night. Hold in my ears for me. Yeah, <laughs>